Well, spent half the damn night redoing the springs, put, taking the front springs out, putting them in the back. Back ones goes in the front. We had that pass backwards, but that's all good now. That's a good thing. Got the whole front end button back up. About ready to put this transmission onto this motor. Get the torque converter lined up. And pretty soon we'll have this some bitch in ready to run. I think. This car has been my dad's unicorn. He's always wanted a 62 Impala SS convertible. He had a perfect 62 SS hardtop sitting in the garage when I came across this one in a barn. It had been sitting untouched since the 80s, and the owner was selling me parts for my 65 at the time, and I caught a glimpse of this one under a pile of junk that was stacked on top of it. I convinced the guy to give me a call uh, if he ever wanted to sell it, and I pestered him for the next five years or so until finally uh, he agreed to make a deal on it. The car's now my dad's, and his 62 hardtop is long gone. Proceeds from the sale of that car are getting reinvested into this convertible. It's actually a fairly rare option car. Uh, Chevy didn't offer a cream colored top, uh, which they called ivory, with the Nassau blue cars in 1962 for the Impala SS. So this one's somewhat of a, a special order, or at least a rare car as far as that's concerned. We drug it home and quickly determined it was in really good shape. There was almost no rust on the body of the car. Some of the panels had been replaced, and, and, but there was really no rust anywhere. And, and convertibles are notorious for getting moisture in them and having the floors rust out. This one had zero rust and since it was stored in a bone dry barn for 30 some years, which is just crazy. We decided to restore the car with some slight modern upgrades to make it a lot more fun to drive and, and really make it drivable. We installed modern front suspension, which included tubular upper and lower control arms. It's got the CPP 500 power steering box conversion. It's got drop spindles, upgraded brakes all the way around, which are disc brakes up front. Uh, it's got beefy sway bars front and back, lowering springs in the rear to match the front uh, drop spindles. And for wheels, we're gonna run the 17 inch torque thrust wheels. We found an original 327 engine from a full size uh, 62 Chevy that we bought and my brother and I rebuilt for my dad and gave it to him for his birthday. That included camel hump 461 heads with the 202 valves. Uh, we rebuilt it with a comp cam, a little bit more aggressive than stock for some low end torque. The paint's going to be a custom color, really similar to the Nassau blue that was originally on it, but it's going to have a metal flake, so it's going to give it a little more pop. And it's going to be a two-stage paint job with the uh, clear coat as well. I'm really excited to see how this car turns out and since my dad has been lusting after it for a really long time, I know he's going to really enjoy it. Yep, we're peeling her back just like an onion. Let's see what the beauty is on here. Look at that. Vintage Detroit iron. <laughs> Look at that. She wants to run, we know that. <laughs> okay, let's see if there's a potent meal in here. <laughs> Oh, that dog. <laughs> We're gonna have to move this gizmo. Right there, there we go. And hinges are nice and grease. Look at that, buddy. She wants to run. She's pack rat free, though. That's good. <laughs> For now. <laughs> For now. All right. Yeah, as soon as we do something nice to it, that's what we need. <laughs> we'd be, we'd be riding high. About ready to fire it up. Yeah, all he needs a real strong motor in it right now. You can't hardly hold the thing in one place. <laughs> he wants to burn up the highway. We got the, so far we've all we got in it's a custom interior. <laughs> no, it's not really custom. It's a minimalist. Yeah, it's minimalist. But we've taken it back from the rats today. They thought they were going to get away with this one. We've taken back what's rightfully ours. That's right. Yeah, we just got through doing that a custom cross member back there. And we're all good to go. Ready? Yeah, yeah, looks like it. Got her jacked up so it won't fall on us. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Looking good. We're hoping for a easy installation here. That's what we're really hoping for. All right. Well, without all this uh, core support in the front, it sure as hell ought to facilitate that, but you never know.
You never know. I've never really had a smooth installation of anything, I don't think, in my life. <laughs> Good. Here's hoping. No, yeah, right. All right. Just makes me as happy as a pig in the mud, I tell you. I'm beside myself. Yeah, correct. It's been a long time coming. How long has it been? Three, four years since we first got this? Or, I don't know. About that. Mm -hmm. Three years, anyway. It sat out one winter out there and tried to keep the rats out of it. And it was a job. There wasn't nothing left for them to eat, though. It was all ready. <laughs> yeah, hang on. So, 327, 62, all tubular front end, CPP steering, conversion, drop spindles, tubular control arms. Gonna run the dual snorkel. Where'd you get that thing? Off a of Corvette. My, that one right behind you. It's under Can't. wraps. Uh. That's what it come off of. That'll be a later video. Well, what do we got here? It looks like one seat, huh? Not, not one seat so far. Looks good. Sia Della's uh, interior package. Nice. Evan got her all lined up for me over somewhere in Tacoma, I think. Uh huh. Yeah. I can't wait to get all that shit on there. White top, putty. Get this uh, Athens blue painted. A couple coats of clear. You won't be able to stand it. <laughs> We'll be doing that parade that you talked about in that That's previous right. video. I'll be giving the queen wave. <laughs> have have uh, that auto sound thing that Evan gave me. Have that thing cranked up with 50s rock and roll. Big people just hanging over it, trying to get in. <laughs> That's happened. They can run and jump in. <laughs> That's going to be good. Good work. Yeah. Good work today. No kidding, man. And last night. And last night. We got more to show for what we did today though, than we did last night. What did we do last night? Just fix all the mistakes. That we made last time. <laughs> yeah. Circle of life, isn't it? Uh, Something like that. Yeah, exactly. But now, this is actually forward progress, you know, not two steps back. One ha Right here is one half of the Ernst Brothers Garage Team, and here's the Patriarch. <laughs> <laughs> we we got her done though, by God. She's in. She's in. And she wants to run. Yep. 62 SS drop top. America's car. <laughs> 